All right, legends of the world, welcome back. Okay, so we're a little bit familiar with flash and moving stuff and frames per second, animation, motion, stuff like that. So let's go ahead and use, um, let's go ahead and talk about the 3D rotation tool that flash provides us. So let's go ahead and create a shape. Let's convert this bad boy to a symbol, selection tool. Just like that, insert, nope, modify, convert to symbol. Symbol, and I'll call this three dimensional. So in the past, we weren't doing really anything three-dimensional. We just had the same shape that was moving around, but the shape wasn't moving at all. Let's go ahead and make this shape animated, 3D. Okay, so um, I'll just create it 24 frames per second. Our animation will be one second long, then it'll repeat. So go ahead and find the 24 FPS, F5, just like that, to create a new keyframe, or enter, or new frame, I'm sorry, it's 10.30 p.m., and let's go ahead and create motion tween. But instead of grabbing the selection tool, let's go ahead and grab this tool up here. And you might, I know of the new, I have the new version of Flash. It already might be underneath it, or the 3D translation tool might be covering it, but this is the one that we want, 3D rotation tool. Now, there's a couple lines in here that we can toy around with. We have the Y axis. I'm not gonna move anything. I'm just gonna demonstrate what, what I'm talking about. Here's the Y, this obviously moves. Man, I hated geometry. Y moves up and down, X moves left and right. So don't let that confuse you. Then you could grab this, pull this in. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab this yellow shade right here and I'm gonna go ahead and turn it around kind of something like that. Kind of like an orbit. Uh, just like that. So let's go ahead and publish this. So let's go ahead and hit command return if you're on a Mac or control return if you're on a PC and see what happened. It's moving around. I don't like that at all. It should have been 48 frames per second. So fool around with this, fool around with the uh, 3D rotation tool. Uh, like I said, I use this a lot in Flash. As you can see, you could just click around through websites and you could see advertisements portraying things like this, shapes and circles moving around and stuff like that. That's how you do it. Play around with the tool, change it around from um, 48 frames per second, slow it down. Let me know if you like it more. All right, guys, good luck with this. I'll see you in the next video.